As the world moves more online, our clients will become more demanding. For most businesses, a simple website that has a home page, an about page, a services page and a contact page just isn't enough anymore. They want to display their products and services in a much more dynamic way so that they can also deliver a great experience for their clients and stay in business. So once you've built a few websites with Elementor, you will soon realize that you will need Elementor Pro for bigger websites. For example, to create a header or a footer template or to create a template for a blog post. But then, once you become a little bit more professional, then you will realize that even Elementor Pro doesn't have it all for more complicated websites. For example, if you want to create a listing website with filters or a booking website for a hotel, how are you going to do that with Elementor Pro? And the worst thing that you can do is say yes to a new project when you don't even know if you can build it and if it's possible within the budget of your clients. So in this video, I want to show you what I think is the best solution for your business to solve these kind of problems for your clients while keeping it affordable for your business and even make a profit when you buy a plugin like this. And in more complicated website projects, a few hundred dollars, it's not a real issue anymore. Because if you can build websites like this, you can sell your websites for a few thousand extra. Simply because not a lot of people have the skills to build websites like this. So that already makes you a more valuable player. And also for your client, the alternative that they have is to go to a professional agency where they probably will spend like $10,000 on a website like this. Well, you can do it for much cheaper and keep most of the revenue in your pocket. So if that sounds interesting to you, then let's just get started. So dynamic content websites are websites where the content changes based on the data input. The most simple kind of dynamic website is a blog, where each blog post has the same layout but different data inside of it. But also a portfolio website with different kind of projects, where all the projects have the same data but the structure of each project post is the same. And if you want to create a custom blog, you will only need WordPress and Elementor Pro. But if you want to create a portfolio website, for example, with dynamic content, you already will need a few plugins. You will need to create a custom post type for this new kind of post portfolio in this example. You will need to create some custom fields with advanced custom fields so that you can create more fields than just the normal blog layout. And you will need to create your own custom blog with Elementor custom skin, because otherwise it will always look like a blog, the same way as I did in my portfolio series, for free. So besides Elementor Pro, you can do this all for free, which is great. So where this becomes interesting is with things like custom listings with filters, booking systems, advanced search options, and full WooCommerce customization. And this is where CrocoBlock comes in. CrocoBlock offers a set of plugins, which you can buy for one price, by the way. And their plugins have all of the features that I just described. First of all, this is a benefit because the more plugins you have on your website, the more problems can occur. So it's much better to have different plugins from one company because they probably work a little bit better together. And they didn't combine everything in one plugin, otherwise that plugin will be huge and then your website will be slow. So if you need advanced search, you will just download their advanced search plugin. If you need a booking system, you will download their booking plugin. Their most popular plugin is called Jet Engine. By the way, all of their plugins start with Jet in front of the name. So Jet Engine offers already what custom post type UI advanced custom fields and Elementor custom skin can do in one plugin. So there you already save two extra plugins that run on your website. But then still, why would anybody pay money if you can also achieve this thing for free? Well, those free plugins come with limitations. And if you want to have all the features that Jet Engine offers, you will still have to pay. For example, with ACF. So here I'm on the website of advanced custom fields. So there is a free plugin. This is the paid version. Here, the repeater field, that is something that you get with Gent Engine, which is very useful in custom post types when you don't know how much items there are, but you want your clients to add items inside of a post. So for example, with people or with locations or with anything. Uh, this option pages, very essential. For example, if your client has a phone number that changes over time and that phone number is in 
25 places on the website, you don't want to go to all of those places and change the number. So with option pages, you will get one place where you can put a dynamic field and then use that dynamic field on the whole website. So that is super awesome. Gallery, for example, a dynamic gallery is not part of the free version. You will have to pay for that with ACF, but it's already included in Jet Engines. So let's look at their pricing because this is the most popular custom field plugin that there is. So here you can see their pricing. And if you want the unlimited package because you want to use it for different clients, you will need to pay 250 per year. That's a lot of money. There is no option to pay for a lifetime. So that means that you are just stuck with this one because the chances that you're gonna sell more 10 websites that are a little bit complicated over time is very high. So that's why you will need this package. So let's now go to Crocoblock and see their pricing. So if you would only buy their Jet Engine plugin, which has all those features, you will only pay 50 per year. That is approximately five times cheaper than ACF Pro. But I do not recommend to buy this. I do recommend to buy the full package, which I will cover in a minute. Because Crocoblock also offers a lot of other plugins, which are very nice. So for example, filters, like I talked about. So when you have a client that has a big web shop and you want filters, you can include the filters. And as you can see, you can customize the design. This is super, super nice. And this is their search plugin. And with the search plugin, you can have a pretty advanced custom search field where it automatically loads the post without going to a separate page. Look at this. How cool is this? Or let's say that a hotel or a car renting business approaches you. With Crocoblock, you will have the booking plugin. So here you can see that you can create a whole booking website and you can customize the design with Elementor because that's what's so beautiful about Crocoblock. It's built on top of Elementor. There are two more that I wanna show you. First one is the menu. So with Elementor Pro, you are very limited with what you can do with the menu. And here you can customize your whole menu and make a mega menu, like you can see over here. And even show WooCommerce products, for example, in your dropdown in your menu or a, a map like this. Super cool stuff. And the last one that I wanted to show you, which I am going to cover in one of my other videos, is the Jet Woo Builder, which lets you customize the WooCommerce experience so much more than what you can do with Elementor Pro. It's absolutely amazing. You can combine this with the filter and with everything they offer. Look at this. This looks like a professional big website. That is super cool. And what they also offer is some extra widgets called Jet Elements, but that is not really interesting because there are a lot of companies that offer this also, but then for free. But it's nice that it's there. You have everything in one package. And that's what I like about it, that you don't have to have a lot of plugins on your website. Everything is within your Crocoblock subscription or your lifetime deal. That's what I will show you. It's actually not that expensive. So you can see Crocoblock like WordPress and Elementor Pro on steroids. It's a whole package with everything you need to start building and selling websites for for bigger money. But of course, this is not free. But to be honest, I haven't seen any other company that offers something like this, which is what we miss from Elementor Pro. So now I'm gonna show you their pricing. So if you go to the pricing page, you can see that they have a lot of pricing options, which is a little bit confusing. So the only thing you really have to look at are the last two. Of course, you can pick one of those if you have just one client and you wanna test it and maybe you can just charge your client for it and test how it works. But if you already know that you're gonna build a few more complicated websites in the future, maybe the next year, then this is a great investment. So they have an all-inclusive yearly package. So all of those plugins, but that's only for one website. So you need to switch this one and then it's only 265. Re again, remember ACF Pro is 250. This is the most popular custom fields plugin now you have this whole package which is much more than ACF Pro for $10 more and then to make it even better they have a lifetime deal 
So then you will only have to pay once. And this is where it becomes really interesting for your business to make a profit. Because if you sell a website that is more complicated, so for example, that has filters or a booking system, or just a little bit more complicated than what you can do with Elementor Pro, and you use Croco Block, you could just say to your client like, hey, the software that I need for this is just a little bit higher. It's not gonna be a yearly price. It's a one-time fee of 250, and that is just for for my tools. And you can explain that to your client in the same way as your car company repairs your cars. So you will pay for the person that actually fixtures your car, but sometimes you also pay for some parts. And this is the same way with CrocoBlock. That's how you can say it to your client. So what I do is when a client approaches me and it's a big project, then I just charge $250 on top of my price just for the plugin. And then I only have to sell three of those websites in the next five years, 10 years, that doesn't really matter, in order to pay for this plugin. And then I have that plugin, which I can also use for my own website because I have the unlimited package for a lifetime. And maybe when you're clicking on this link right now, by the way, the link is in the description, so you can check the price right now, because maybe the price is a little bit different. I am in Europe right now, but I think that this price is the same for everybody. Again, the link is in the description. But let's say that you think that this amount is just too scary. It's too big. You don't want to make that investment. Okay, understandable. So what is your alternative? So let's say that you have a client uh, which wants a website and you only need actually jet engine, right? So then you could go for the normal one website package and just go for the dynamic package. But this is a yearly price. So then you don't want to pay this. So you charge your clients for this. Then they will have to pay $85 per year. Well, $85 per year times three in three years, they already paid more then what they would pay you if you would have the 750 package, you see, because this is already 255. So this is not a very smart deal, even if you let your clients pay for a single site license. Just tell them in three years, it's also going to be 250 because you need to pay for the subscription yourself if you just want a single site license. So in my eyes, just always charge your clients a little bit in your offer for plugins cost. That is just the tools that you use. They have to pay that. Otherwise, it's hard for you to make a profit, especially with small websites. But with big websites, I mean, let's be honest, you're selling a website, hopefully, for a few thousand dollars. And then 250 for tools, it's not that expensive for your clients. And I know a few thousand dollars maybe is not a good price for when you're in Asia. Uh, but when you live in the West, you shouldn't sell a website this complicated for less than 3,000. That's what I do. I start my projects from 3,000 euros. So actually that's $4,000. But of course I do have a little bit more experience. So maybe you wanna go a little bit lower than that. So let's say when you don't have a lot of experience, you sell your website for 2,000, then 250 for plugin cost. It's not that much for your clients. And I know this is a lot to digest. Maybe you don't wanna make the decision yet. That's all okay. The best I can do for you is try to make as much tutorials for you as possible on YouTube, which I will do. I will make more CrocoBlock videos in the future because I really believe that this is a very, very great product. And I love the lifetime subscription. I hope they will keep it there because that will make it much more affordable for us so we can actually still make a profit with our websites. And for the people that are still watching, you have an advantage because I have a little discount link. And yes, this is an affiliate link. So I do get a small commission when you buy it via that link, but you will also get 10% off. So I think that's a win-win. And to be honest, without those links, I wouldn't be possible to make this many videos on YouTube. So you don't pay anything more. Actually, you pay less. And you also help me by making these videos, making a lot of videos about CrocoBlock so that you can actually start building more more complicated websites and sell more to your clients. So here it is on the livingwithpixels.com slash links page. Uh, I will also put that link in the description. So if you use the, the code livingwithpixels10, you will get 10% off. So just click on this one, then you will go to the affiliate link. Then you can just go to the pricing page. It will save that link so the system knows it's you. Then you can buy the product over here, put it in your checkout, 
have a discount code, just copy the code from here, place it over here, click on apply, and as you can see, now it has become a little bit cheaper. So this is for the people that are still watching. Sometimes they also have greater offers, which is, for example, with Black Friday. But I think this is already a nice discount. Okay, so I hope that you now see the value of investing a little bit more money into your web design business so you can actually start selling much more high price websites to your clients. Yes, it's an investment, but I think it's a smart investment. I don't promote a lot of products. Believe me when I say that I get at least two, three companies that approach me every week and I only promote a few uh, companies and I think this is a great one. So thank you for the support. If you wanna see more videos about how to start your own web design business, then Living Web Pixels is the place to be. Then I hope to see you in the next video and then I'm gonna say cheers to your web design business. Thank you.